Okay, so it's about three o'clock in the morning. Still haven't got any sleep whatsoever. Um, I still just feel like I'm ticking. I feel like I could go for another workout, so I'm probably not gonna double scoop again. What if I spit on the tune, I'll boss it. <laughs> What's going on guys, Cameron Fitness here and I am back with a brand new video. So I've been looking for a brand new pre-workout, been asking around to try to get the strongest one and just give it a little go. And if you look guys, we are so close to 300 subs, so if you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button and leave this video with a like. So I've just picked up a tub of LFT SHT, pronounce that how you want, and every single review has said it is the strongest pre-workout on the market, similar to the old version of the Jack 3D. So I'm going to go hit a shoulder workout because I haven't really featured a shoulder video on my channel before. Uh, gonna try two scoops of a pre-workout and we're gonna see how it goes. So let's quickly get a change first. That's better. Let's go! Horry and his brand new coffee machine. I thought yeah. so. I thought, Horry there. I thought the Longy coffee machine. <laughs> <laughs> I sponsored this product. It's oh, like yeah. an advert. Mm-hmm. Mm. <laughs> I've got a palm corner. And then changes your thing. <laughs> that is freaking wicked, I'm telling you. How many scoops did you have? One. One scoop? Only. What, did it send you off your head? It pushed me a bit further on. D Dean, had, um, Dean had one and a half and he said it felt high. Is it like them FP chocolate Oh, honestly, if you'd have had two scoops of this, you'd have been off your head. Try to live the right life, my eyes wide and I strive to stop my demons gripping, ripping from the inside. Honestly, my nan has bigger biceps than him. <laughs> <laughs> So fuck them niggas, none apologetic. I'm copacetic, my genetics is the real nigga. You too pathetic, wear the medic, I'm a ill nigga. Ahead of time, paralyzed, don't feel niggas. God flow, this the God flow. Million dollar convos in the condo. Say my name, turn the lame in the John Doe. Cream as I'm voicing a laugh. Yeah. Who is this kid and where is he from? What is this shit and what has he done? Talking the shit, what is he done? Yeah, I'm having fun. <laughs> this is his plan, it all seems so simple. Reading his hand, it looks like so simple. What? Thinking again, it's Chi was samples, man. <gasps> Give him a sip. What is your plan and why do you do it, man? I don't know why I pursue it. When I get angry, I just do it more. Damn, they I hate it, now answer the door. I've been out banging them, banging them. So guys, overall lift shit is a very, very strong pre-workout. My caffeine tolerance is really high because I drink lots of coffee. Usually I always have pre-workout just before my workout and it still sent me absolutely off my head. I felt absolutely wired on it and it lasted quite a long time after as well. Now in terms of pre-workout, I'd always recommend you kind of have maximum of three weeks on just before your session and then have a week which is kind of like your detox period where um, your caffeine tolerance will gradually decrease so then the pre-workout will hit you just as hard when you start it again. The last thing you want is when you're working out to get solely dependent on your pre-workout. It's really good for kind of keeping you focused uh, and getting you really nice and energised for your workout but you can't solely depend on it. But guys, that is the end of the vlog so once again, if you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button, leave this video with a like and I will see you next time. Peace!